Join us for the very first IFL Live at London's Indigo at the O2, Sunday, August the 13th, with me, Coogan Cassius, and some very special guests, Eddie Hearn, Darren Barker, Johnny Fisher, and more. Tickets now on sale. So in the words of Eddie Hearn... You get up, you dress up, and you fucking show up. Oscar Bevis, IFL TV, proudly sponsored by Everlast. We've got a little backing track, it's only right. Then you're a singer as well as a boxer. Rancho on Cruiser Zone, thank you for giving me some of your time. Uh, how are we? I'm doing great. I got my blood flowing, a good little workout in, I'm good. Welcome to Manchester, welcome to England. Um, last time we was on here, Coogan had you singing. But we're into fight week now. Are things a little bit more serious or have you still got that kind of bouncy energy? I mean, when, when you're doing something you love, you're always going to be happy. <laughs> of course, you know... I'm in great shape, as you can see, different from the posters, but um, it's always serious. As you can see, when I was face to face with Savannah, it's, it's work time, so yeah. What did you see in her eyes when you went face to face? You should ask her what she saw in mine. She saw determination, she saw a winner in her face. That's what I saw. Through the reflection of her eyes, I saw a winner standing right there, and that's me. Obviously, it's not the first time you guys have come face to face. I watched the gloves are off on the way up here this morning. Really entertaining. Um, I felt like it was a bit of an emotional roller coaster. We had a sing song. We kind of had some tears as well. And you tell us about your motivation for this fight. Um, but was that good fun to film? Yeah, you know what? I, I can respect Savannah. She's a true professional. And her fight name is Silent Assassin. She's not a big talker. And it's always been that way. Um, it was cool. It, you know, at the end of the day, we're both women fighting in a sport where we're suppressed and for us to be headlining is, is great for us, it's great for us. Is that important to you then kind of, yes, you want to walk away with the belts, yes, you're a champion and that's kind of your, your mentality, but is, it, is there kind of a bigger thing to all of this then for you as well? Yeah, just like I said in, in the gloves off, it's, my mission is bigger, you know, she's playing her part, she's done her part, she's a two-time Olympian, I mean, you look at the old fighters like Ali and Frazier and, and George Foreman, they could tell you stories about when they were younger. We have history now. We're making more history, you know? Well, we can't wait to see you two get it on, on Saturday night. Um, there's going to be kind of comparisons made because it's USA versus the UK in terms of the Clarissa fight. Um, can you see any comparisons inside the ring or outside between the two fights? Between me and Clarissa? In terms of you and Savannah and you and Clarissa, can, is there anything you could perhaps see as a kind of a... In similarities, uh, Clarissa is a dog, respectfully. I'm a dog, respectfully. And we both, the reason why we always bumped heads and as the amateur is because we don't have any given us and we're going to fight to the end. You can hit us a thousand times, we're going to hit you a thousand and one. And that's what I respect about her and that's what I keep inside of me. That's why I'm a winner. Well, I know that Savannah has said on some other outlets that she expects this to be a bit more of a rough fight. Um, she's going to have to kind of dig her heels in. If it is a rough fight, what happens? You're talking to the, the queen of rough. I mean, the way they say it, I don't, know, they say I don't know how to throw a jab or anything. But, I mean, I'm fully prepared to box, bang, wrestle, shit talk. Whatever you want to do, we can do it. That's so American. The whole package. That's what you're about, yeah? <laughs> yeah, I'm just me, man. Thank you for having me here. I'm very happy. I lost one bit of the final package. I know you're probably sick of it. I'm not sick of your voice. As long as, promote, long as you guys promote my uh, new Link in single. the bio to the single. Yeah, link in the bio. It's called Secret Place. We're now number 19 on the charts. So if you want to find out, I'll just ask you the question. Do you want to go to my secret place? You got to stream my song. Join us for the very first IFL Live at London's Indigo at the O2, Sunday, August the 13th. With me, Coogan Cassius, and some very special guests. Eddie Hearn, Darren Barker, Johnny Fisher, and more. Tickets now on sale. So in the words of Eddie Hearn... You get up, you dress up, and you fucking show up.